Hi, my name is Matthew Barrett. I'm one of the consulting cardiologists working in St. Michael's Hospital with the Heartbeat Trust. Uh, I have a special interest in heart failure and advanced imaging of heart function to establish best treatments for heart failure and to guide therapy for patients experiencing heart failure. What is natriuretic peptide? Natriuretic peptide is a protein that our body produces to help keep the heart and blood vessels healthy. It is a good substance. It is mainly made in the heart and is present at low levels in the blood if the heart is relaxed and not under pressure. It can be easily measured by a blood test. We use this blood test to help measure your risk for developing heart failure. It can also be used to diagnose heart failure. Sometimes this test is referred to as BNP, which is simply another name for the same substance. How do we use it to measure risk? Levels of natriuretic peptide in the blood are low if the heart is functioning well and the risk of developing heart failure is low. Rising levels of natriuretic peptide can be an early sign of stress or strain on the heart, which is the first step to developing heart failure. By measuring the natriuretic peptide level in your blood on a regular basis, the STOP-HF staff can be alerted to any change in the heart pump function. If we observe a high level of natriuretic peptide, an echocardiogram or heart ultrasound will be performed to see if there is evidence of strain on the heart. If this scan shows signs of strain, changes to your treatment plan may be required, for example, medication or lifestyle changes. On the other hand, the scan may show a completely normal heart. This does not mean the natriuretic peptide blood test was wrong. It may be telling us that something is beginning to develop in the heart, but it is so minor at this time that the scan does not show it. In these situations, we keep a close eye with follow-up scans and blood tests. Depending on the level of natriuretic peptide in the blood, the test is repeated either yearly every two years or every three years. This test is not widely available and is usually only measured in people with or suspected of having heart failure. Therefore, your GP would not routinely measure your natriuretic peptide levels as part of your usual blood tests. This is beginning to change in the coming years as the Irish Health Service focuses its attention on the prevention and early identification of heart disease. If you would like more information about natriuretic peptide levels or their relevance to heart disease, please contact the Heartbeat Trust via their website.